Yo, what is up guys? So for today, we're going to be talking about Destiny 2. Now specifically, we're going to be looking at the Hunter Revenant class. So just like the Warlock, these are my first impressions. We're not going to be talking about aspects or fragments just because we didn't do that with the Warlock. And I, this is just basic, like, what do I think off the bat? So I actually think the Revenant class is fun. I like it. And I know you guys are like, do you like it? I know it sounds like I'm I like I, I I don't I'm not sure I like it don't get me wrong I think it's cool I think the withering blades are really cool you when you basically toss a stasis shuriken at targets to damage and slow them uh, if, if we want to freeze them we have to throw the other one which is why I don't think they're necessarily that useful sometimes because sometimes I just want to freeze them because like the warlock one melee and they're frozen instantly so there's give and take with this class, considering do I want to out outright freeze them? That will take both my melee charges out, but at the same time, they'll be frozen. Or do I just want to slow them? Uh, I don't see the hunters necessarily being broken. I, like I said, Warlocks, I immediately knew once that melee ability be uh, just froze people off the one charge, I was like, this might be a little fucking crazy, considering Warlocks get a get an exotic that gives them two melees plus with high strength and monte carlo it's gonna be fucking gross you can tell me oh well the hunters can do the same thing really not like no like we have to use our both charges so instead of like the warlock where it's literally one charge and boom you're frozen the hunter we literally have to throw both of them at the same time and then yeah people will be like oh yeah you're frozen and you get other people at the same time that's all our that's all it is though like we just have extra steps it's literally the same thing with middle tree arc in my opinion where we could have had a charge a shoulder charge or a one hit melee or a one hit kill but instead bungie was like no you guys have extra extra things to do you have to slide and then melee to do something cool so it's just kind of the same thing for me this is and by no way me bitching about that i think it's fine i don't really care withering blade is just dope already so I personally don't care it's just that i think comparing that melee the warlocks melee specifically to the hunter melee and the titan melee it's you you really see the disparity because the warlocks again instant freeze that my guy instant freeze and it has a bit of tracking and it can go a pretty decent amount i'm not alone on this thought so i will that's all i'm gonna say so again withering blade i like it uh, I actually like it a lot more. I do think the targeting is a bit shit sometimes. But from what I've noticed, every class, I don't know what the fuck it is, but every class has targeting, like most of their shit is targeting really badly. Specifically the Titans. We'll get to the Titans later. But the super itself, I think the super is fine. I do think a lot of people are going to be like, oh, it's broken. I I guess. I don't know. I it's another panic super don't get me wrong i don't want it and i didn't want another panic super personally i would have loved that these uh these uh what what are, what are these are even called uh commas yeah i would have loved it if these commas were like actually duration based as in like i get to hit people with them as a melee or throw them or something i would have much preferred them to be like once you pop your super you start running with them and then you get to throw them and they do the same thing not the same thing but they do similar effects as the super works now so like maybe if you left click or right click it throws each or so like let's say if you left click you throw you throw silence which uh freezes and damages damages targets but if you want to throw squall, squall then you can right click and it throws it obviously to a lesser degree not anything that crazy i would have just preferred that because this is literally just uh, blades, uh, a thousand blades, I forget, Shards of Galanor. I don't remember that super. I never remember that super's name. I just remember it as Shards of Galanor. What's it called? Let me see. Hold on real quick. Uh, blade Brush. It's literally just Blade Brush stasis. That's really it. So I would have much preferred if we were able to like run with it. Uh, silence and squall and then just throw them out right like oh boom I, I just froze and and damaged that guy definitely definitely think 
the damage output would have needed to be reducted so that way it wouldn't have just been that insane but at the same time this could have worked almost like top top tree or bottom tree solar for warlocks so for me i think silence and squall as a super is okay it's basically blade uh, blade barrage like i said it's just that i would have preferred a little bit more unique a little more unique uh look on that yeah i it's just kind of boring to be quite honest it's good it's just it's it's boring dog is it's very like it's a very safe choice for a hunter it's a panic super it's that's really it <coughs> let me know your thoughts in the comments below personally i just don't really care for it it's i don't want to come across like i don't like the super i love it it's really fucking cool it's fun as fuck it's just i would have much preferred us basically run around with like like basically middle tree void it would have been cool because we could like, like essentially if we dodge we gain i don't know what's it called we gain a protective uh we, pro we, we gain a protective layer of stasis that would have been cool like just a little bit more imagination with the super would have been dope because a panic super that throws two sh uh commas for me just ah uh, dude i don't know man this super just it's so polarizing because like on one hand i like it because it's just something i'm used to but at the same time that's exactly why i'm bored of it because it's something i already know how to do like i think like hands down i think the titans have one of the most fun ex uh, supers in this game right now their super is so fucking fun i'm not saying overpowered i'm saying fun their shit is fun uh the warlocks is probably the weakest when it comes to like not weakest like power wise i'm talking more like fun wise theirs is cool and very stupid in pvp but when it comes to just in general it's just point and then explode i'm not saying that's not fun i'm just saying like that's very very generic in my opinion hunter also very generic titans though dude they go slam and then they go bop i love it i don't know what it is but yeah let me know your thoughts in the comments below that's really it <clears throat> these videos are usually just me uh reviewing the supers and the melees because that's only really the only things that are available to us the aspects and fragments i'll review them later when i have them all mostly because my hunter is the only one that has two and my warlock and titan do not because i hate doing the strangers missions for them they're actually gross as fuck and i hate them but yeah let me know your thoughts hunters what do you guys think are you guys uh in agreement or disagreement let me know in the comments below if you guys want to follow me on my social media outlets links are in the description below thank you everyone for the constant support i really do appreciate it and other than that i will see you guys later